Enjoy this free episode from My Outdoor TV. Buckle up, get ready for a fun ride. With over 20,000 episodes of the best outdoor shows with your free trial, we're the home of the adventurous. We're in a bad spot. We need help. The champions. When it's your time to win, you can't stop it. The legends. There are bigger things happening out here than just shooting bullets at end. Start your free trial of My Outdoor TV right now. Twenty-seven years ago, I set out to be the best to ever play this game. And for a good part of those 27 years, that goal alone pretty much consumed me. And your number one qualifier this afternoon, Levi Morgan. This is what he lives for right here. Bows and arrows have always been a huge part of mine and Samantha's life. And God has allowed both of us to accomplish more than we ever imagined. Along the way, he showed us it's not about how many championships we win or how many trophies we have, but instead, it's about our faith in him and our love for each other. Samantha and I now have two boys that mean more to us than all the trophies in the world. And we're thankful for every minute of our life together. Guys, we are kicking off this season in one of my favorite places in the world, and that's Bighorn Outfitters, Wyoming, Montana. And I just so happened to have drawn one of the best elk tags in the country in Montana. I've been putting in for for a couple years, um, and I know Dustin and Rich have some monster bulls on this place, and I love the elk hunt. Cannot wait to get that started. We've got a full camp this week at Bighorn Outfitters. Myself, Samantha, Andy Morgan, Darren Christianberry and his son Dylan Christianberry all in camp. We're hunting mule deer, whitetail, antelope, elk, you name it. It's going to be a heck of a week. I've said it before, Bighorn Outfitters is heaven on earth to a bow hunter and I cannot wait to get out there and start checking some Browning trail cameras. Wow. Oh, seven by six. Dude, that's a giant, bro. That's a big bull. That's such a good feeling. Well, after we check all the cards on the Brownings, we confirmed that there are some monster bulls in this unit, in this area. Um, but the first couple days for us is really slow. The weather's not right. The bulls just aren't talking. However, Andy has had an eventful second day from the get-go. Had a little malfunction. Slight setback. We okay, sun's coming up. We'll get things fixed. It's live. <laughs> Nothing like spending prime time when you should be glass and fixing the tire. All makes for a good story. Let's go find a deer. Well, 
they get the spare tire changed and get back to glassing and it didn't take them long to turn up a super unique bug, just gnarly, massive bases. And knowing Andy and Rich, if they get a good game plan together, this buck's days are numbered. Well, we found one that's pretty unusual. It's got some, actually an odd side, some trash on his bases, some good mature buck. Decided we're gonna make a play on him. So now the fun begins. A lot of looking, but you know, you gotta be selective. Tons of deer here, tons of bucks. And it's kind of, I'm not gonna say just like pick one you want, but it's kind of one of these deals you scout till you find one you want to hunt, and we finally have. So we are making a move. We've got a great wind. Only problem we have is a doe and a fawn. The buck's bedded, and they're above him right now, which they got a bird's eye on us, so they're kind of between us and the buck, which is gonna complicate things a little bit. So we're just letting it settle, take our time, and sneak in there. I mean, we've got plenty of daylight left and just try not to get in a hurry and make this first stalk a good one. End it right here. We hope you've enjoyed this free episode. To continue watching, start your free trial now.